click on the subscribe button to watch more videos on my youtube channel to get latest notifications and updates about my videos click on this bell icon hi friends in this video i am going to explain how to develop a nameplate by using autocad first of all open the autocad and first i am starting with the rectangle command the shortcut of the rectangle is rec enter on the command prompt it asks the uh, specify the first corner point i will giving the first corner point and drag it like this and give the dimension d enter and the length and the width give the length and the width of the rectangle i am giving the length and the width is 250 into 200 mm all dimensions are mm see the one of the rectangle is created by using z enter by using zoom i will get like this check the dimension by using linear 200 mm and the dimensions of the top of the line is 250 mm and the length and the width is 250 into 200 mm all dimensions are mm you want to change the dimension style go on to the d enter the one of the command this is and the modified dimension style standard dialog box will appears so i am giving the text height to 10 in previous it is showing 5 mm i am giving the 10 of the text of the size is 10 mm then i want to give the m text command m text enter and specify the point on the inside and give the name what you want i am giving the first of all give the company name on the name plate whatever you want as your wish i am giving the company name of the size of the text is 6.0 the the size of the text should be 6.0 this is the minimum or you can should follow this dimensions the minimum of the equipment for example the company name should be in 6 mm height the height of the text is 6 mm then i am giving the client for example after giving the company name on the below of the any of the name plate has the client name i am giving the client see the client is should be in 4 mm the height of the client is should 4 mm you should take the 4 mm height see you want to move the text uh, to move the any of the point by using move command or using a copy command already explained in previous tutorials you want to download this drawing go on to my description link the nameplate of the autocad drawing is available on the 2010 format i am giving because uh, so many um, files are not opening in the other previous versions this is the using i am using the 2016 autocad software is 2016 version so many people are using the previous version then only i'm converting this drawing to 2010 format in the description the download file is available first the company name is created simply i am giving the copy command co enter and give the client client name what you want then i'm giving the client select the client and the height of the distance is 4 mm the nothing but a height of the text is 4 mm the height of the text is 4 mm see by using the linear command you can check the dimension by using linear the company name is 6 mm you should 6 mm and the client height is 4 mm then after in the name plate uh, has some boxes we also observe in the name plate first draw a line how much the space remaining space is required first check the dimension by using linear this is the one of the technique for example if the remaining is 201 i want to check this is the process and the 10 mm by using rectangle command same as i want to give a box like this for example 201 mm into the height of the box is also 6 mm distance and the 6 into 250 or 250 201 into 6 sorry 201 mm into 6 one of the rectangle box is created like this see on the vertical it is showing i want to give the horizontal Uh, to change the dimension what you give on the rectangle command that will appears on the autocad screen 
I'm giving the dimensions. Uh, it asks dimension D enter. Then I'm giving the 201 into 6 m. The remaining space is uh, like constant. The 201 distance C, the one of the rectangle. The six, the block is 6 m. On the inside block, you want to give the text of 4 mm height. The height of the uh, text is 4 mm, and the box should be in 6 mm distance. Nothing but a height. Mm, this is the 6 and the 4 and the 6 is completed. The two boxes and the company name and client. You want to in between the distance you should maintain to the uh, one box to the other box should maintain the 3 mm distance. I'm giving the in between the distance uh, in between the space nothing but a space of the any of the box you should give the space of 3 mm see in 3 mm as per the section standards I am constructing this nameplate uh, see the 3 mm distance I also observe the screen you also can observe by using the linear dimensions and simply copy the client text and simply delete this and I am giving the private limited for example I am not giving any of the company name because of the uh, problem may occurs then the private limited for example you want in the petrochemicals like uh, any of the chemical limited you can give the name of the client and the company name also on the top and the below on the below this is the boxes you can create like this by using the copy or move command by using client like this you wherever you want to construct a design a uh, uh, the business nameplate or uh, any of the nameplates are for the equipment design like this the engraving should require for the nameplate as for the fabrication terms i will explain next tutorials uh, and the manufacturing for example supplied by the manufacturing number my manufacturing number is nothing but the equipment number a manufacturing number date and some of the reasons shell tube like different types of inspection stamp you want to construct like this this is the process I am explaining by using the AutoCAD this is the one of the rectangle 200 into 250 mm nameplate I am constructing as your wish you can construct the nameplate by these techniques and by this tutorial also and the supplied by I am giving the shell for example you take as a reactor for example it is a reactor drawing you want to construct for reactor drawing I want to require a specific nameplate I will give the shell tube like this. You want to give different lines. I am giving the line and giving the dimension by using area and check the dimension linear same as previous. Use the rectangle command and drag the point onto the top of the horizontal line to the end and give the dimensions to area we want. You want to delete the lines. You can delete the lines also. See one of the rectangle is completed. The rectangle is very simple to use you can use line it take a lot of time a lot of time is required by using rectangle command that four lines are created in less time in between the distance is 3 mm and the length nothing but the height of the box is 6 mm length what you want on the in between the distance are to compare with the equipment the nameplate will develop by this tutorial see this is the nameplate you want to give the rivet holes copy the uh, I am giving the offset command O enter in between the distance after the space in between the stairs of the distance is 10 mm required this is the minimum requirement I am explaining or the maximum large equipment you can give the large equipment you know you require the large nameplate also this is the minimum requirement 6 mm 4 mm like this I am explaining this is the minimum the nameplate should be in accurate position and the holes I am giving the whole diameter is 5 mm simply offsetting the same line same rectangle to 5 mm and I am drawing the line or uh, line at the end of the circle I am giving the circle and simply copy the object to the four points so the nameplate has already you know nameplate has four holes on the riveted it is engraved with 1.5 mm deep the text will engrave in the engraving process the 1.5 mm deep is required this is the specifications required for the nameplate I'm only explaining these are the different types of fabrication terms are also there I will explain my previous tutorial this is the so much time is taking this tutorial I will explain in my next tutorial 
I'm giving the simply giving the size or the size by using the copy command simply copy the any of the text you will save the time to prepare any of the object like this in AutoCAD if you well experienced you are beginners you are using AutoCAD you can practice more uh, already in experienced engineers are experienced draftsmen should follow this type of techniques and the beginners should follow the proper techniques at the command prompts not using any of the simple techniques then you are not well experienced in this designing process uh, the designers like this 250 into 200 mm into 3 thickness see the size of the 250 into 200 is completed i'm giving the by layer different type of colors i want you wish how much size is required and how to create a name plate like this different types of designs are there this is the one of the process i'm explaining in my channel is 215 to 200 m3 and uh, you should uh, require the uh, most high size of the name plate you can also create by using like this this is the one of the tutorial i'm explaining for the name plate design this is the minimum requirement or the minimum specifications to require to follow the specifications to develop or construct a name plate on the autocad by different types of dimensions this is the minimum dimensions or the basic dimensions should follow to develop this drawing this is the nameplate drawing